You know what? I was so excited to, I am so excited to do this video. Hi, everybody. Um, my name is Jemmy Lily Brielle. I'm so ready to get a new laptop after I really get this channel going so I do not have to keep doing videos on such an old laptop. But here we are. We're going to work with what we have, okay? And I've got the infrared light. I've got a cool tie-dye shirt on. Welcome. I will provide a visual. I can provide a visual description as well for uh, the scene impaired. So I am wearing a tie-dye strapless shirt. I have brown highlighted hair, black or brown highlighted hair, brown eyes. And yeah, let's do this. I'm Jamila Libreo. Jamila means beautiful in Swahili and Arabic, just in case you were curious. And yeah, so the video title is why I'm clearing my dating roster. And so many hearts are unfortunately going to be broken with this video. But I know that this is the right thing to do. And I'm so excited about this video. So um, I think that for me, like dating is really about like making a friendship first and foremost with someone building any kind of relationship, whether that's a relationship with your friend, with family members, um, just any type of relationship, um, you know, especially personal relationships. I feel like friendship is a great way to build trust. And so that's like a lot of how I approach dating or like people I meet like on dating sites, you know, just meeting them like as real people. And for me, like, you know, it's, excuse me, it's all about the friendship, but, you know, for me, it's really, um, eye-opening, like, some of the experiences, like, I've had recently, and I've had this, like, on my heart of, like, clearing this dating roster. I've had this, like, on my heart, like, for, for quite some time, and for those that don't know about, like, uh, rosters, then I'm not really quite sure, like, how you ended up, like, on this video, um, but that could be, like, a whole different video just on the concept of rosters, so I'm not specifically planning to touch too much on that, um, per se. <laughs> However, um, it might come up. So I just wanted to give that disclosure. This is also not medical advice, not legal advice. I'm not a licensed therapist. I'm not a licensed medical professional. I'm not a medical professional, period. Like if you need some type of help or advice, like, you know, talk to your doctor or therapist. So my videos are more so just like from my own personal experience. So, um, I'm not a lawyer, <laughs> okay? Um, so, yeah, this is just my real life on my own. My opinions are my own. They do not reflect anybody else's opinions, my family's opinions, my friends' opinions, my colleagues' opinions, anybody else's opinions. These are my own opinions, okay? So thank goodness for that, okay? <laughs> and so basically, like, you know how I've been feeling now that I'm four minutes and 12, 14 seconds in the video, um... I felt like that was a little bit of my disclosures. Um, but yeah, let's pretty much like get into the video. Um, 
this is improvised, by the way. I don't have any bullet points or anything on this one. But uh, like I said, I've been thinking about this a lot. And so, like, first of all, like, that friendship, as I stated before, like, has to be there. And, like, to me, it is a little, a little off-putting that people could share themselves in such of an intimate way without getting to know someone. But I'm going to say that with the caveat of I respect everyone and what they would like to do in their life as long as they're not hurting nobody. Like, by all means, do you. Um, I understand not everyone, like, needs a personal connection. However, I just think for me personally, like to be vulnerable and close in an intimate way with someone I want to know who they are. And I think also, you know, when we start thinking about health and staying healthy, like that is also like a big part of it. And I found that not everybody is up to date on their testing. So that is a red flag for me. Like, and I will also say just inconsistency is a big thing for me. Like inconsistency. I don't like inconsistency. I don't like communication that's not direct. And so those are some of the reasons why I'm clearing my roster. Okay. And let's see what else. I think, you know, the consistency has got to be there. The friendship's got to be there. Right. Um, and the safety. So those are the three reasons why I'm clearing my roster. Consistency, safety, and friendship. Those things all need to be there. That should be essential to any type of, um, relationship at least like I would personally like to be in I don't know about y'all but um that's pretty much it I know that some people want shorter videos some people want longer videos you know it's all about the watch time so it's like I've gotta just keep talking and talking and talking and talking anyways but um I can't appreciate a short video for sure um like I said those are like my main bullet points and there could very well be a part two to this video but I'm curious to hear from you all about what kind of expectations that you have for your dating roster let me know and let me know if I do a part two what you guys would like to hear about so be sure to like comment and subscribe and it's Friday night. I'm going to enjoy my night, okay? Um, let me know what y'all think about this video. And if these are good reasons to clear my dating roster, let me know. Ciao.